South Korea has declared the end of the COVID-19 pandemic. And starting next month, the country will mark the complete return to normalcy, with all remaining antivirus restrictions to be scrapped, including the mandatory self-quarantine for those infected with the virus. Our Kim Jong-shil starts us off. On Thursday morning, President Yoon attended the COVID-19 disaster control meeting with 12 medical personnel, including doctors and nurses, who have been working tirelessly since the very first COVID-19 case in South Korea was reported back in January 2020. 아, 일단 그 입고 있는 그 옷부터가 아, 너무 덥고 활동하기 너무 힘들고 아, 하여튼 그뭐 실제로 가서 보지 않고는 아, 의료진들이 얼마나 힘들고 고생을 했는지 아, 느끼기가 쉽지 않을 것 같습니다. 이분들의 그 <웃음> 협업 덕분에 팬데믹을 극복할 수 있었습니다. The government has also announced changes to the remaining COVID-19 related measures. From June 1st, the seven-day mandatory isolation period for confirmed cases will be reduced to a five-day voluntary isolation. The recommended PCR test within three days for people arriving in the country will also be lifted. And the indoor mask mandate will be lifted in all places, only except for hospitals with inpatient wards. It's possible these new changes could come in sooner depending on the administrative process. Kim Jong-sil, Arirang News.